morning, 73 degrees at 8.40 on this Monday, August 20th. Here's what's happening. The Lizzie Grubman case goes before a grand jury today. PR Princess Lizzie Grubman ran down 16 people. In order for this case to go to trial, the prosecution really needs a grand jury indictment against Grubman. To determine if the district attorney has presented enough evidence to indict Grubman, they expect to wrap things up next week. Can you tell us what you told the grand jury? I'm really not going to comment about the grand jury testimony. Can you say what they asked, what kind of questions they asked? He, he can't comment about what the grand jury has said or what he told them. No, I asked yesterday. What did you talk about in the car with them? Why they were called today? Were they well, there? Well, I think you'd have to ask the district attorney why they were called. <laughs> Stop. You've got enough. Excuse us, please. Excuse us. Excuse me, please. What type of rational person would run over somebody and then try to flee the scene? I just basically think the girl has emotional problems or uh, she just can't communicate properly. They're trying to make it a bigger deal than it was. I think it was an accident, and I think the media is making it a lot more exciting. It sells papers. A little room, please, guys. What'd you tell them, Lizzie? Excuse us, please. We saw it on the news, and we read about it in Newsday. She left the scene of an accident. She ran over 16 people. So we want to know what happened. I'm sorry, no comment. Lizzie, what about blaming the victims in this case? Sorry, right now we have no comment. Did they provoke you, Lizzie? Did they provoke you? Did you call them white trash? No comment. What you see here today is really just a, a, an example of the public interest in the case. And for whatever reason, it has struck a nerve with people, and they're reading about it and uh, are interested in it.